I know you're gonna dig this. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Brooksy HD. Today we have a squad builder, 100,000 coins. These usually do the best on my channel, so I thought I'd do another one. Anyways, before we do that, I want you guys to add me on Snapchat. As you can see on the screen somewhere, there's a Snapchat code. You can add me via that, or you can add me by the username, which you'll see on the bottom of the screen as well, uh, which is Decini. You can add me on that. Add me on uh, Snapchat. Send me a video question. Make sure it's a video question, not a picture or a chat, because I won't be answering them, and you will get. Get featured in the video more than likely get featured in the video if you send me a video question ask me anything guys i don't care just try and be creative so uh the same questions don't get asked over and over again and uh, i'll be answering these later on tonight so as soon as you see this video uh add me on snapchat you know what pause this video add me on snapchat send me your question you can even send two or three if you want i don't really care um the more the merrier hey and yeah i'll be answering them later on tonight so no i won't be answering the snapchats i'll be i'll be answering them on camera and i'll make a video for it going up tomorrow hopefully tomorrow if not it'll be up on tuesday so let's get on to the squad builder. sorry about that that was for my 6k special by the way that's what the video is going to be a snapchat q a i cannot explain shit at all <laughs> Anyways, yes, we have a 100,000 coin squad builder in the 4-3-3 back of 4 formation. We have three team of the seasons in the team, some incredible players. Let's get into it. So in goal, we have one of the best German goalkeepers in the game. He's in the Bundesliga. His name is Bernd Leno. Just a really solid goalkeeper. You know, just nothing else. I've used him so many times. He's a beast. In defense, we have two Leverkusen teammates of Bernd Leno. We have on the right, we have Inform on our top rack. And on the left, we have... Uh, team of the season, Jonathan Tab. I've used Jonathan Tab before in a squad builder, and he was a beast. So I thought, you know what? Let's use him again. He goes for like 25k. He's a steal. With 99 strength, you cannot go wrong. On our top racks card is really solid as well. They're just really good defensive centre backs, and that's exactly why they're in the team. In the fullback positions, then we have two. For obviously for two fullbacks, what what else would they be? We have Caesar as Filipeta on the left, and we have Mario Fernandez on the right from the Russian league from CSK Moscow to be precise. I like Fernandez's card because he's got medium high, and I like to play with my fullbacks on stay back while attacking, and um, especially on a wide formation, it really helps the defense, which is exactly what these two fullbacks are on. As Piliqueta is a really solid fullback as well, he can attack and defend. They're just really solid players to have in the defense. The midfield then is where shit gets interesting. We have Fabregas, Kazorla, and team of the season Zagwev. Zagwev's card is a beast probably better at, at a cam but uh, at centre mid he's still a beast we've got Fabregas great players Cazorla are great you've probably used both of them before but I would definitely use Zagwev he goes for like 14k it's a steal boys on the wing we have a team of the season and an inform that is a pretty sick inform I'm not gonna lie we have team of the season Dennis Suarez on the left and we have Oleg Shatov's inform Shatov really great name son on the right wing uh really solid card stats for uh, Oleg Shatov and Dennis Suarez card Kind of disappointed with it, I'm not going to lie. So, if you want to use any other player that is Spanish on the left wing in the La Liga, like uh, Munayin, for example, you can use him. Yeah, he wasn't great, but you know what? He's a team of the season. <laughs> and he links up perfectly to the striker. He was a fucking beast. And that striker, ladies and gentlemen, is... Well, we won him yesterday. Team of the season, Ruben Castro. Absolutely sick player. This guy makes them kind of runs you want from a striker. If you set him on getting behind, he will just run through the defence. You slot him in the through ball, which is why Cazorla, Zagalev and Fabregas are in the team with high passing stats to be able to do that stuff. And that's why the passing stats are good on the wingers and the... F uh, yeah, well, on the wingers and fullbacks. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. This team is really fucking sick. How many teams in the season? We have four teams in the seasons. I'm a complete and utter liar. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this 100k squad builder. Don't forget to add me on Snapchat and send me some questions. I'll be answering them later on tonight. So do them as soon as possible. Let's get on to the clips. All right, then, guys. As we get on to the clips with this team. Now, I'm not going to lie. I don't know what they've done to this FIFA, but they've made it so this formation isn't... As OP as it used to be. It used to be so fucking sick in this game. It's still good, but it's not as good as it used to be. Ruben Castro, however, is a fucking beast. Look at this goal, man. What a absolute finish. If you go on the full head and check his stats, I'm pretty sure he's going to have, like, high 90s finishing. He is a beast. Positioning, as you can see right there, really high as well. He's always in the right place. He is the perfect poacher. Like, literally, if a ball gets saved... He will get on the end of it. That's how good he is. He's oh, he makes the right runs. He's so fast. He's brilliant. Honestly, one of the best strikers I've used in this game. Minus four star skills. I think if he had that, he'd be a complete striker. Like really, a really sick striker. Uh, but see, this is what I mean about the positioning. He's always in the right position. He's he's incredible. The rest of the team then. Dennis Suarez. Well, let's talk about him. Highly disappointed with him. He wasn't great at all. Uh, to be honest, I thought he had four star skills. 
found out he didn't and he was pretty shit. He's, he's not really fast enough. He's good passing and good dribbling, but that's about it. And he got shot off on the right. He was the complete polar opposite. He was absolutely fantastic. I loved using his card. I think the Russian League is probably my favourite league this year. Just because how cheap all the players are. And you've got some OP players in the team. This goal by Ruben Castro, I really thought was sick. He missed the first attempt. Picked up the ball on the ha on the on the boy line, and he still scored. He's incredible. The midfield then of Santi Cazorla as he scores in an absolute banger. Uh, really sick passing midfield. Fabregas as well. Zagoev is a god. Uh, uh, I wish I could have used him at like centre forward or something like that. I tried to use uh, Hakem Ziyech, but it's really hard to link him in without spending a shit ton of coins. So I will get him in the squabbler eventually. Um, yeah, Zagoev is a beast. Fabregas, I really do like his card. He's a bit slow and a bit weak. Other than that, he's a great card. Um, you got the fullbacks then, Fernandez and Azpilicueta. I almost forgot who was in it there. Uh, yeah, really sick. Like, just defensive and attacking fullbacks. Mario Fernandez gets a sick goal in this. I think you've already seen it. Um, center backs then of Jonathan Ta and Owner Top Rack. Great center back. Special cards as well. So, you know, there's the wow factor in that. And then you got Burnt Leno. Old Mr. Reliable himself. Um, he's just a great goal. This goal, this was what I was meant to... I've seen this goal and thinking that was a great goal. Leno's a good goalkeeper. That's what I wanted to say. Castro is a fucking god. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget about Snapchat, because I really need some questions for that. And I'll see you next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.